I'm going to tell you all with a tear in my eye. This is the greatest moment. BDSIR Network. I'm a one man jam podcast. Like a special, like special show. I have guests in the house. And, uh, well, I'll let them introduce themselves because they, they know who they are. And they go by the name of. I'm Rufio from Australia. And I am Jern Simmons from the Netherlands. That's right. We got, oh no, we got a run in. We got a run in from, from Naba. He's, 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 got, he's, he's got a steel chair. No, please don't stop. No. <laughs> Not a steel chair, it's just a protein chair. Yeah. Oh, it's just a protein chair. Yeah. yeah. It's easy to get the wrong. He, he's, he's not a, he's not a he's wrestler. Who's sad? Hmm? Is he depressed? Who's sad? No. Sad? Sad? Sleep. Oh, sleepy oh. and tired. Fair enough. Uh, I was studying and now I'm going to sleep. Oh, that's right. Hell yeah, dude. Cool. So, Rufio is Yo. from Australia. Yeah. By way of Netherlands. So, so you've come from Netherlands to Australia, or Australia to Netherlands? No, no, Neverland. Neverland. Oh, Neverland. Yeah. Oh, okay. Neverland. Yeah. So he's from the home of Peter Pan. Yeah. And Fairy. And Tinkerbell. Yeah. Tinkerbell. Is that where you got your wrestling style from, or? Is... Yeah. Okay. I thought so. Every day. <laughs> yeah. What about Captain Hook, man? Huh? Never heard of him. Please don't mention his name. Oh, it's oh it's, it's, you like a long rival ribbon? It's, like, it's like a Voldemort sort of thing. Oh, shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's in a hate word. Don't, don't say his name. I mean, technically, it's a C word. C word? Yeah, because it oh, starts the, with cat. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So. Come on, man. Yeah. Um, don't, don't say the C word. I'm, I'm the one that already finished a can of cider. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, we can say cider. We can, oh, say, we can say the C word, this C word. Yeah. Okay. You can't say cunt. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're going to edit that out. Sorry, Actually, you know what? The, the, we, we can swear, we can cuss. It's, it's okay. Oh, yeah. we, can, we can cuss. Oh, yeah. um, if you want to say. Yeah. Freak. Heck yeah. yeah. Heck yeah. And um, back in the day it was hell yeah, but now apparently it's heck yeah. yeah. How things have changed, eh? Yeah, man. Yeah. yeah. You're, I don't even know what the H is going on here. Yeah. The H? Yeah. No. What's that? What's the H? Nothing. Moving on. What, what, what are we trying to do? We're having an interview right now. And, uh, yeah, you're part of the interview now. now you're, you're part of the interview, man. Yeah. What's, what's your gimmick? Oh, well, I'm delighted to be part of the interview. How are oh, you? You look wrestling, ec- man. Uh, you, look, <laughs> you look ecstatic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thrilled. <laughs> like, is there not so great Carly? Calm down, bro. <laughs> So Jern is from the Never, Never, the Netherlands. That's different to Neverland, yeah. I think they're close to each other, maybe graphically. Probably, actually. Sure. We'll, no, we'll have to look that up on that. Never Neverland, man. Oh, really? Never. Yeah. You should know. Never. Damn. Never ever. Ever. Not even in my wildest dreams, Shad. <laughs> <laughs> Shag or Shad. Uh, what is the what is the house name? What is the name of the house uh, for of Michael Jackson? We live in. I think it was ne- uh, Never uh, Never Ranch. Neverland, Neverland Ranch. Yeah, yeah, ne- Neverland yeah. Ranch. Yeah. Where you touch all the blue boys. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I've never been there either. Yeah, I'd like to go there. Would yeah. you? Hell yeah. Well, well, well pre Michael Jackson or after Michael Jackson? Uh, In other words, do you want your boy, butthole <laughs> touched or not? Basically. Oh, man. Hell yeah. By Michael Jackson as well. Yeah. Get on those rides. Yeah. Get on those rides. Yeah. Michael Jackson. Jack Jackson. And the Ferris wheel. <laughs> the Ferris wheel. Is that where he just hangs, hangs upside down naked and spins around? I need to learn more about this than I <laughs> I've just been there doing my research. Yeah, okay. Hell yeah. Speaking of research, is it XP? No, XWX or WXW? WXW. WXW, that's, that's, it. It. that's yeah. the one, yeah. That is in Netherlands. No, it's no, not. It's, it's in not. Germany. It's Germany? Yeah. Okay, that is Germany. And then do you wrestle oh, there? I'm just talking to you. Yeah, okay. Um, yeah so that is in Germany. Now we've discovered. Like, there's some people that don't know. Some people don't know where XWX is or WXW, WXW. WXW is. Yeah, it's really not that difficult. Yeah. <laughs> it's two letters. What do you stand for? Yeah. Westside Rest- Extreme Wrestling. Hell yeah. Okay. That's Extreme with an X, yeah. Because it's a hardcore. Yeah. One X or two X's. 
Just one. Just one. Just the one. They're, they're German, so they're conservative. Oh, yeah, yeah sure. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so how long did you wrestle there for? I've been wrestling there for about four and a half years now, something like that. Okay, I that's still that's wrestle, that's I still wrestle there. So I, I, I watched one of your matches and I uh, noticed, man, you you got rid of the locks, the long locks, man. Or did you lose a, a hair versus hair match, or was yeah, it by choice? Did you, you lost a hair versus hair match? I lost a hair versus hair match back in October. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh shit! No way. So oh. there's a big storyline going into it. Of yeah. Me against David Starr. Okay. And uh, yeah, I lost the match and I lost my hair. Oh man. And since then, I've been bald ever since. It, it grows back. Maybe. It do, yeah, it does, but I just tend to shave it. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I do like this look. It looks much more, more sinister. And to be honest, if you check 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 him out on the Twitter, you are on the Twitter. I am, yeah. Uh, Twitter, uh, Instagram, uh, Facebook, Tinder. You know, you can grind, you're on Grinder. No, I'm not on Grinder. No, I'm Grinder. Yeah. Okay. Nah, exactly. Some you, people might want to ask about like, oh, yeah. I, I know you try looking there for me, Shaq. <laughs> I want to ask you something again. Yeah. Sure. Okay. Go ahead, Roof. So. When you had your hair, would yeah. you consider yourself a beefcake or a twig? <laughs> a beefcake or a twig? With or without hair. With hair. With, no, but with or without hair, I would, would classify myself as a beefcake. Okay. Sure. All right. What about me? What do you think I am? I think you're more of a twink. Fair enough. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I agree with that. Yeah. So, Rufio, yeah. you're, you're more of a, a high flyer type. Type. Would, would you class yourself as a high flyer? I wouldn't. I wouldn't say that a twink and a high flyer go hand in hand. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a bit twink and high flyer. Yeah. Okay. Into the style blend. That's that's sort of unorthodox. Yeah. It's special, man. I think uh, Pat Patterson would like you. I want to meet Pat Patterson. Would you? Hell yeah. At the Neverland Ranch or just. Oh, where are you, why are you trying to imply shit? <laughs> no, why are you just making this interview? <laughs> no, no, I'm a fan you of ask, You ask us for a very cordial interview, and then you try to make all these assumptions and uh, no, allegations. No, no, no. <laughs> allegations. allegations. It's not allegations. I'm asking questions. I'm uh, trying to do some research here and find out if you are I a fan. Mean, a I fan feel like you should have done the research before the <laughs> interview. That's how, that's that's how, how it works. works. Yeah, oh, okay, that's how yeah, it works. You know, do no, I've done, I've done it. The <laughs> well, no, no, hang on a second. I, I know these answers, but the listeners don't. Oh, uh, all right. Yeah, see. So right. these are, these people so, are meeting you for the first time. So I'm trying to let them. I'm speaking through them. Okay. Okay. Yeah? All right. Okay. Do you ask them what they want to know? Nah, I don't know. who cares about them. <laughs> what a twist! Wow, you're, 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 I'm joking. Really disrespectful towards your listeners. <laughs> no, no, I'm, I'm joking. <laughs> they, they, they know me, man. They know how I, how I roll. All right. So you have uh, been here for how long in the UK? Uh, for you. Two months now. Two months? In this country. Okay. Handy. Where was you before that, before you came to the UK? Um, I spent a month in Germany with the WXW. Okay. Yes. And then I have just been in Australia. Okay. So how, how, long have you, how long have you been wrestling all together? Like six years. Six years? Yes, sir. And you're 26 now, yeah? No, uh, you're 26. No, I'm 27. 27. When was your birthday? August. 29th. August 29th. Ah, see? Yeah. Bit of research there. August 29th, which is coming up soon, so we can send your birthday cards oh, to... Oh, please, please don't. Okay, he doesn't like, he doesn't, he doesn't like fans, or he doesn't like cards, or he doesn't like birthdays. I don't, I don't really care for birthdays, honestly. Oh yeah, birthdays are special ones, my way, it's just about you, not like Christmas where it's about everybody else. Yeah. Yeah, but birthdays aren't really special, because everybody's got one every year. Yeah. So... Mm, true, but what you so trying to say? Yeah, yeah. So, so do you prefer time? your birthday or Christmas? Would you prefer a birthday present or Christmas present? I don't, I don't, I'm not a big, big fan of presents. Honestly. Ah. Okay. I like, I like riding solo, being a lone wolf. The lone, the lone, the lone wolf. <laughs> 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 it's a lone wolf. <laughs> Rufio's down! Rufio's down! Oh. Yeah, take it easy, take it easy. We almost have another dead wrestler on our hands here, man. Good, yeah. So, X, WXW, yeah, yeah, in yeah. Germany. In Germany. How long was you, have you been wrestling there? 
Uh, I already told you about four and a half years. Yeah. Four and a half years. Yeah. And where was it before that? Before that, I mainly did. Uh, I started out in pro wrestling Holland in the Netherlands, and I did a. I, you know, did pretty much all of their shows when I started, and uh, did a couple of Belgian shows and other shows in like France and Germany here and there. Okay. So, so well, what made you get into wrestling? Like, what made you think, yeah, I'm gonna, I want to be like him? Who was the person you pointed out? I'm like, that, that's who I want to be like, or that's, my, that's what I want to do. Trish Stratus. Okay. Hell yeah. yeah. I looked at her and yeah. I was like, yep, I want to get into the wrestling yeah. business. <laughs> so. Well, that's not a bad uh, role model to have, I guess, Trish Stratus. I yeah. mean, she's, she's definitely got the T and the A, you know. Yeah, Obviously, that's an Albert, right? Yeah. Test, test is, well, I guess now she's just got the A because Test is no longer with us. I don't know if that's breaking news to to you guys. No. No, you know that Test is gone. No. You didn't know Test is gone? No, no, I knew. Oh, you knew yeah. Test is gone? Yeah. So it's just all about the A now. Uh-huh. Yeah. Now, look, on, on, a, on a real, like, what, what made you get into to wrestling? Or was it really Trish Stratus? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, but I mean, it's I not mean, I, feel, I feel like Trish was a big reason, though. No. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I think every every teenager's dream was to get into the wrestling business for Trish Stratus. Sure, like, yeah. I was, say. I, I was a Melina girl. I, I like Melina. She was she was she was there for my time. Oh, she was after your time. Yeah. So you grew up you grew up in that attitude era then. Yeah, as, that's as it. Call it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It I, was, like I like I uh, I got into wrestling at like the tail end of the attitude era into whatever was next. Ruthless aggression. Yeah. So. Uh, yeah, and like I just watched it and thought it was super cool. And I, I was always like kind of aimless in life, you know. As a kid, I never knew what I wanted to be. And then I saw that and I was like, you know, that'd be pretty did, cool. Did, I, I heard you got a job with security. Is that right? Yeah. Okay, how long did you do that for? Uh, for about like six, seven years. Something like oh, that. that's, a, that's a long time, man. I mean,. It's just like a regular job. Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, you get to put your hands on people, and then that's probably what led to Not really. Yeah. No, that's, that's not the case at all. You're making all these assumptions. <laughs> I feel like I feel like kind of attacked. You know? <laughs> like you're just like putting words into my mouth. You know, like it's, uh, the role of a security guard it's, is to keep the peace. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So if all things go well, you don't have to put your hands on people. That is and true. It's not, it's not a game. No, what it is? It's a wrestling. <laughs> that's, not, that's not how it is. I see what kind of story you're trying to form here, the story you're trying to tell, but that's not the case at all. All right. Oh, I wasn't okay. like some kind of like aggressive security guard. And I started wrestling, and I was like, "Yeah, I want to do that. And beat the crap out of people." You know? Oh man! That's not I've, got, I've got it all wrong. I'm a, I'm actually a huge pacifist. So really. Yeah. Oh, okay. I go to rallies and everything. You know, hold up the banner, like oh, don't okay. fight wow. or whatever they do. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so you, we did security, and then yeah. security into wrestling, or did you have another job? No, man. It was. Uh, uh, I mean, like I already did wrestling on the side. Uh, uh, another run in there from Rufio. <laughs> bless you. Bless you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Got you. I did, I did. I already did wrestling on the side when I did security. So okay. And then it just kind of went from there. Yeah. Okay. But you know, the two don't really have a connection at all. It's just. I thought no, I went to people like uh, Diesel. He first came in as a bodyguard when he first came into the, to the WWF. I feel like people yeah, had yeah, people had jobs. <laughs> Back in, in the era, in the 95 era, the people had jobs and then they came in, the, like Vince would look at you and be like, oh, you're a security guard, that is your job, okay, you're going to be security for Booker T or something like that. Yeah, yeah. okay, yeah. I, like, I don't know, I wasn't backstage back then, so I don't know well, <laughs> how it works. Well, that's kind of how it was. Like, you, you have to have, basically, back in the day, you had to have a second job as well, and yours was security? I don't, I don't think I had a second job. I really doubt Shawn Michaels had a second job. Um, what do you think, Rufio? Didn't he do uh, Playgo? Yeah, I don't know what that has to do with anything. That's all I mean. When I think <laughs> about Michaels, I have a lot of gay thoughts here. Yeah, by the way. Well, I'm, just there. I'm just having a lot of gay thoughts this tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why. Maybe it's anything. a cider. Yeah. yeah, it must be the cider. Yeah. Nah. Um, who, who was your influence? Growing up? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Me in wrestling? In wrestling. Or life. Or both. Uh, the parents. The parents. That's yeah. a good one. 
Yeah. You've got to, you know, listen to your parents. Who is your parents? What, 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 what would I? Who would I? Who would I? Who are your parents? Who are your parents? Yeah. <laughs> I gotta know. Got, you gotta, you gotta tell us what the people wanna know. I wanna ask. <laughs> <laughs> are they on Tinder? Oh, 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 come on, Chad. You took it that one step too far. You took it that one step uh, too far. No, no. In, 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 the in, in, in the wrestling business, let's, let's try and keep it to wrestling. Sure. Or sports entertainment. <sighs> I mean, it's the same thing. Sure. Sure. Yeah. So. Fine. Who, who was your influence? Who did you look at and think, I want to be like you? Um, I never wanted to like be anybody because I would, I've always thought it's always important to be yourself, you know? That's true. Uh, <laughs> that is true. That's pretty deep, deep, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah, it was, man. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, you're so deep. <laughs> uh, but uh, a wrestler I enjoyed watching was Edge. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He's my favorite Edge. to watch. Yeah, Edge and Christian, or just Edge. Uh, mostly Edge, but I enjoy Christian as well. Okay, yeah. well, Edge, Edge's career ended early, so he was he was around more. I think I think more more as a tag he's, team wrestler. He's, he's here to kill the mood, yeah. yeah the no, no, I'm not kidding. Like, yeah. Every time you bring something up, you go yeah. like, yeah, you know, like. I add my parents. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I'm Edge's retired. And I'm Edge's retired. Edge died. Yeah. Uh, okay. People, people know me as bringing up. People know me on the on the BDSR network for bringing up death a lot. So that's horrible, it's, man. Maybe change your image. Yeah. Yeah, you yeah, have to change my image. Yeah. Well, I'm an Undertaker yeah. fan. That's why. I think that's what that's what it is. Because I'm an Undertaker fan. He was my person growing up. And yeah, he's not dead. He's a, yeah. the dead man. That's his name. That's his gimmick. Yeah. The yeah, dead man. It's, it's a gimmick, man. Yeah, it's not real. This, yeah. Is, this is my he's gimmick. Not, he's not I... dead for real. Shit. I I don't know if I'm. But you got buried alive. Numerous times. Yeah, man. It's uh That's that's a dead man on TV. Yeah. It's gonna be an open conversation after this interview. Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> you have to break it to you. Yeah, you have to tell me that yeah. 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 Like, not now. I'm, yeah. I'm not I'm not I'm not a wrestler, I don't know how it works. But all I saw was a man get buried on TV, put in a put in a box and, and close the lips and then that, yeah. that was the end of him. And then he flew up in the sky and then I was like, Wow. That's all Undertaker. Yeah, there's there's, there's, there's the zombie taker. Uncle Undertaker. <laughs> Uncle Undertaker. Wow. <laughs> it was, you know, it was Uncle Paul actually. Uncle Paul. I don't know if you remember. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, no, he's passed away too. Thanks oh. for reminding us, Shad. Yeah. Fucking oh, yeah. hell. Yeah, he, he gone. He's such a Debbie. Yeah. yeah. Oh. yeah. Oh. On, on You're like Britta from Community. Yeah. Right. Because <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> oh, no, we were watching it today. I don't know what that is. So I'm sorry. From the TV show Community. No, no, I don't know. Ah, it's, come it's, on, is that a wrestler thing? No, <laughs> no. It was like Channel Four. Not, not yeah. everything has to do with yeah. wrestling. Channel Four. Right? Yeah. We're people outside yeah. of wrestling as well. That's what I'm trying to do. I'm, get to, I'm trying to get to know the people. And I know that you've got. You've yeah, got... Why do you keep bringing up wrestling, man? And death. Yeah. <laughs> that's 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 yeah. half of who yeah. I am. Wrestling and, and oh. death. Yeah. But um, so it's moving on from wrestling, just, just yes. for a little bit. Okay. Yearn. I know that you are a Dragon Ball Z fan. I am, yeah. Oh, so, really? so, yeah, tell us yeah. about that. Yeah, I love Dragon Ball Z. Dragon Ball Z, yeah. okay. Yep. Since you was a kid. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you for coming. I'll see you guys later. <laughs> what, do you, what, what do you want to know? How, how long have you, have you liked this Dragon Ball Z stuff? Oh, like? Probably even before wrestling, though. Before like, wrestling? Yeah, man. Dragon Ball Z, I mean, like, that was my childhood, man. Like, pretty much everything about it. I would, like, I would sometimes... Uh, I would just like have my parents videotape the episodes as I couldn't be there. I'd have to be like, I'd have yeah. like a football game or whatever to play, you know, because a young athlete, all that kind of stuff. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> it's a stud from a young age, is what I'm trying to say. Uh, but uh, <laughs> but yeah, and then I found out it was an episode I'd seen already. But you know, that's whatever. Yeah, but I'm a big fan of Dragon Ball Z. I still like I. Uh, I've seen all of Dragon Ball Super as well, and regular Dragon Ball, and I have two gacha games on my phone called Dragon Ball Legends and Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle, which I play on a daily basis. Okay, and is that just uh, a one-player game, or can people add to you and play with you, or against you, or...? Uh, well, Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle is more of a one-player game. I mean, you do have a friend system in it, but it's just, you don't really do anything with them, I guess. Uh, whereas Dragon Ball Legends also has a PvP system, but oh, okay. I'm not a huge fan of the PvP. No, so. nah. okay. So apart from Dragon Ball Z, man, what else are you into? 
Uh, big fan of Game of Thrones, okay. which ended this year. Yeah. I'm a big fan of the of the show Vikings, which I think is going to have his last season sometime soon. Big fan of a bunch of other anime, you know, like Full Metal Alchemist. Clash of Titans. Clash of the Titans. You mean Attack on? Atta- oh, Attack, Attack of the Titans. Titans. Yeah, Clash of, ti- Clash Clash of Titans. Titans is also with Sam Worthington, right? Oh, the, the... The remake. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Sam Worthington, sure. also yeah. known for the Unabomber. Yeah. yeah. Also, so, also known for Avatar. Right? Yeah. But uh, Mayhunt Unibomber, check it out. Netflix. It's alright. Subscribe now. Oh, you work for you work for these guys. I wish. You want to put them all. I work for the same word. <laughs> As all Australians do. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, re- yeah. I'm, I'm, no. I'm, I'm oh, going to oh, your, your time's sorry. up now. You, you stop, stop hogging all oh, the, okay. hogging the line now. Yeah, we got we got to share it. Hey man, I, just, I love the spotlight. All right? <laughs> You so, you so graciously give it to me every time, Shad. So. <laughs> I feel like the people need to get to know Rufio a bit, but I mean, he's all we know is that he's, he's from a man Australia. Of mystery. Yeah, international yeah. man of mystery, a bit like um, Austin Powers, Mysterio. James Bond. There you go. Like Mysterio. Yeah. From Spider-Man? Yeah, he's a mysterious guy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure. I haven't seen the movie. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, yeah. What's your question? What's what's what kind of stuff are you into when you're not wrestling? Like, what's what's your thing? Like, we know that Yearn's a big um, Dragon Ball Z yeah. fan, and he's into his uh, hentai porn. What? Oh, <laughs> wow! <laughs> wow. Love hentai. wow! See, yeah. see, I'm at one assumption, right? So. We definitely didn't have a conversation about hentai in the car in the yeah. car before here. Hey, uh, what, what, do I, I what do I like? What do I like? I like uh, I like video games. I like uh, working out. What, what video games are you into? Um, like watching UFC? Huh? Well, watching UFC. Oh, you're a UFC guy as well? Yeah. Okay. Um, uh, I'm not playing any video games now, but uh, I've just finished Final Fantasy VII. Ah, okay. It's an old one. Yeah, yeah, I know a lot of people like that as well. Um, yeah, I watch Netflix. I like sleeping. I like eating. That's pretty important yeah. for, pretty uh, important. for, for, for yeah. all of us, to yeah. be honest with yeah. Do you have a, a strict diet or do you just eat? Uh, I've got like a certain amount of like uh, calories and uh, macros I need to achieve every day, but it's pretty loose. Like, just as if I have like a, a rough estimate of what I get. And do you have to? Do you make do you make notes of stuff that you eat and? Uh yeah. Uh, there's an app called My Fitness. Oh app. yeah yeah yeah. I've heard of that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Available on Google Play and the App Store and iTunes. Yeah, I knew a woman that used that. I'm not saying it's for women, I'm just saying that women like to watch their figure. And... <laughs> I never said anything. Again, with these words in my mouth. Yeah. No, I'm just saying that you're trying to watch your figure clearly. Like, well, yeah. not clearly, but like, obviously you want to say it. Not clearly, man. Okay. You're so out of shape. Wow. You're so out of shape. Ouch, man. All right. Not my words, though. Just yeah, apparently. Well, yeah. he's you, you, in shape, but it depends what kind of shape. You want to go for it? Man, you keep burying yourself. Steve Brandy's about that. Yeah. That's the Undertaker fan in me, that's why. Okay. Anyway, buried is a word that in the the wrestling world that is definitely overused a lot. People are always like, oh, you get buried, buried. Yeah, Yeah. people use it. People use it way too much. People buried, buried, buried. I mean, when you you watch, do you still watch, do you follow the product WWE? Oh, yeah. Yeah, New Japan. Yeah, absolutely. And then, what do you think of this AEW starting to, to make a rise up? Do you think it's uh, I think it's great, and I wish to work for them someday. <laughs> <laughs> so if you've got, you've got a choice of NXT, WWE, I mean, AEW. NXT is WWE, yeah. Chad. I don't know yeah. if you're aware. No, but you can yeah. just go straight to, to Raw or SmackDown. Would you go straight to Raw or SmackDown, or would you go to NXT? Uh, straight to Raw or SmackDown, no doubt about it. Oh, uh, if I had the choice, I would... <coughs> I'll take whatever I can get, man. <laughs> Not a choice. You take whatever you can get. Yeah, it's man. a great choice. <laughs> okay, well, okay. <laughs> Vince McMahon's got a gun to your head and Triple H's got a gun to your head. Why? Why do they need two guns? <laughs> well, because we don't... Am I going to block the other one? <laughs> <laughs> are they part of the mafia? Yeah, what is this? Well, I think yeah. there could be actually, man. Vince McMahon's no yeah, I don't think so, man. I think you're looking too much into this. Yeah, definitely not. Okay, yeah, no, no gun. No gun. Okay. Sledgehammer and a steel chair. Why are you both of them there? <laughs> Same thing. Okay. Same thing. Different shit. Yeah. Just... Okay, no, no weapons involved. Okay. Yeah. Just a contract. Okay? Sure. Which one would you sign? 
of the companies. The WWE or the NXT? Or the Japan. Or New Japan? No, no, I'm going to ask you something else about New Japan uh, in a minute. Ah, uh, okay. That's, that's the same Okay. Uh, I, w- I would take whatever had the most money and would give me the mo- more opportunities, Chad. Well, NXT will give you the opportunities, oh, okay. but Raw will give you the money. Uh, How do you know? Yeah, that's not guaranteed. Yeah. See, well, you, you're, yeah. You're, on t- you're on mainstream TV, aren't you? Yeah. So you, more faces, more merchandise. Yeah, but I could probably achieve that in NXT, I believe. Yeah, if, if you're over, yeah. Well, let me tell you, mate. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've, I've seen a few matches, yeah. Let me tell you, yeah, mate. I've seen, I've seen Rufio on a couple of shows, man. He's rocking and rolling. It's <laughs> unstoppable. <laughs> Yeah. Rocket. <laughs> <laughs> so you, you would you choose NXT then? That would that would be that would be you. I don't know, man. I'll probably just take whatever, whatever they offer me. Yeah, yeah. I don't, yeah. I don't have, a, I don't have a preference. So would you wrestle for free? Absolutely not. Oh, fuck. <laughs> you said you'd take whatever they gave you. <laughs> what the fuck free? did he even imply that? Yeah. You said you'd, you'd take whatever. So he offered you a contract, no money, but you wrestle. No, nah, I was to take whatever within your boundaries of WWE and NXT. Oh, That's okay. yeah. Mean. So like, I, I don't know what it is. You set the pers- yeah. specifics. Yeah. You can't yeah. just yeah. go rogue. Yeah. 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 I'm, I'm new to this. I'm, I'm new oh. to this. Yeah. Please forgive me. Yeah. Hard left hard okay, then here's, here's one for you. Yo. New Japan or AEW? Uh, New Japan Pro Wrestling. Really? Yeah. Yes, yes, sir. So I have New Japan. Okay, the New Japan or NXT? Oh god, um, New Japan. So ultimately, yeah. your goal is New Japan. Sure, let's go with that. Yeah. And who would you, who would be a dream wrestle wrestle match? Who would you? Oh, uh, New Japan. Yeah, it would be your dream wrestle match. Yo, the, the, the side is getting to me now. Yeah, apparently. Uh, That's all right. And the marijuana, but yeah. we don't do drugs over here. No, no drugs here. Uh, probably, uh, I'd love to wrestle Kota Bushi. Kota, yeah. okay, that's a big name. Yeah. Legend in yeah. the game. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, wouldn't you a fan of uh, Shinsuke? Shinsuke and all? Uh, yeah, but he's not in New Japan. No, no, I'm just saying, when, when you're a fan of him oh, yes. before. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, huge fan. You, uh, you still a fan? Um, yeah, I'd say yeah. still fan. Yeah, fan. How do you yeah. feel about how he's been treated right about now? Like he's come to, to uh, the, the, the big W and uh, he's been treated. Treated, treated. Right? You reckon it? You reckon? Well, yeah. he's just won the Intercontinental title, actually. Yeah. Yeah, he, is. he, beat, he beat Finn Balor for the, for yeah. the title. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. Yeah. But before that, he was hardly on TV. He's not, not getting used I mean, as he should. Yeah. I don't know. You don't always need to be on TV. You know? Yeah. No, no, no. So I was having house shows and they're still get, getting paid, obviously. Yeah. But obviously, you want to be on TV, though. That's, that's your main goal to be on TV. So people I mean, can everyone's see. goal is different. Not everyone wants that WrestleMania dream match, man. Main event. Mm. So we're all like, we're all. But like, like, but okay, don't go, mm, yeah, we're all, Chad, we're all, you're not a wrestler. We're all, we're all, we're all, we're all, we're all, we're human beings as well, man. We don't all just have one robotic Yeah, but if you're, if, you're, like, if you're a wrestler, isn't your dream yeah. to, to be the champion? No, that's what I'm saying. We don't all always have that dream. You can differ between deep person and person. Yeah. We're just different. We're, everyone's a different person. So, okay. And, yeah. I, I know, I know that's probably the propaganda they be in your minds that the dude, like, every, the dude, every, yeah, every yeah, wrestler wants to wave the rest of me but that's not the case we're just regular people it's yeah. true yeah and not everyone can be champion exactly yeah. and I, I think people know that and they make peace with that so they have different goals Good. yeah, yeah. okay I, I can write to that yeah hell yeah so, so what music are you guys into? Yearn? What's what's your uh, go to music or, or, or artist? Well, oh, you're a star. Yeah, yeah, you're a star. Yeah, it's definitely coming back. Yeah, it's, it's got to make a huge yeah. return. Yeah, Bring so back. watch that space. Yeah. Do you, have, do you have Scar as your entrance theme, or do you have a no. particular? Enough <laughs> 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 Scar, but not that much. <laughs> no, I have like. Uh, did you choose, did you choose your wrestling theme? Mm-hmm. And what what was it? What did you choose? Uh, I've had a couple, you know, I had a, I just like a, excuse me, had a pretty, what I thought like was black, was bland rock song for a long time, mm-hmm. which is just a cover of Those Shoes by the Eagles. That, Eagles, I know the Eagles. What? I, I've heard of the Eagles, I'm not familiar with their work, but I know of them. I'm not really a rock you guy. Know, you know Hotel stuff. California? Nah. Oh, uh, Shad. I'm about, I'm about to storm out. Of this. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, I should have lied. Yeah. I should have lied. Yeah. But uh, but yeah, but it's just a cover by that song. But like people seem to be really into that, so I changed it. You know, uh, <laughs> it makes yeah. sense, right? Yeah, of course. I changed I changed it to like a a Viking type song from the band called Vardruna. Just yeah, I know them. Yeah, yeah, I know them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. sure, sure. <laughs> uh, but yeah, it's just so. Like, what's it now currently? What was it? Is it? Is well, it the Viking? Song, yeah, it's a song by the band Vajruga, so it was building up to. Okay. Me off. Oh, sorry, not that. Yeah. So everyone, uh, everyone, can, is that on Spotify or? Right. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It's, it's is called, it? It's called Hellwagen. Uh, but I think I'm changing it again to I'm a Barbie girl. That, that might work, you know. Uh, that could work. Aqua, uh, yeah. aqua, aqua boys. Aqua. Aqua, aqua boys. Where are aqua, aqua from? Are they from the Netherlands? No, man. Oh. I think they're Scandinavian. Oh, uh, Scandinavian? Okay. Yeah, Scandinavia is crazy, dude. Yeah. Hell yeah. They're bonkers. I went to Finland recently. It's awesome. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I really have to say that. <laughs> <laughs> I went to it's Finland. It was awesome. Trip. He's yeah. putting Finland over. It's just a great trip. I don't know yeah. what else to say. So, what, what, what other countries have you been to? Or countries. Yeah. I've been to a lot, man. Like a lot. Uh, I've gone to America, you know. Nice. USA. Oh, the United yeah. States. The Big Apple. Yeah. I mean, that's just New York. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. Chad. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you, you're right there. Uh, but the land truth, of the free? The land of the free? Truth be told, I was hoping you were going to say it. <laughs> <laughs> but, Walked right into it, man. I've been to America, obviously I've wrestled in the Netherlands, I went to Belgium, Germany, France, uh, I've done like Hungary, Denmark, Finland, England, because that's of course, where yeah. I'm now, We're on that, you know. yeah. I've done Ireland, I've done, uh, I've wrestled in like Israel, oh, oh shit, yeah, 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 super dope, okay, no. um, yeah, and maybe some other Wow. But I think that's about it. Israel. Hell yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. I like, I sent it to WWE. Yeah. And they put it on like their website where I did a trial. I was like, yeah, he's wrestling in the Middle East. I was like, hell yeah. Oh, Middle East. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I was like, yeah. 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 Okay, now. See. That's, that's wicked, that is. Yeah, man. Israel Israel was, was also like a, a super cool trip. Mm -hmm. It was also like. Who was that for? Uh, I don't. I honestly don't remember their own the name of the their own country. country? Oh, yeah. Okay. In but, Israel. Yeah. Okay. I just, I just remember the guy who contacted me for it, right? Mm -hmm. Um. But it was like it. It was the same deal as Finland, where there was like a show on the Saturday. Yeah. But they flew me in on the Friday. Yeah. And I flew back out on a Sunday. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we just basically just had like an entire day off. Yeah. And uh. Me and David Starr like went to see Jerusalem. I oh, just cool. like went over there, which was super dope. You yeah. know, because oh, yeah. it's got a lot of history together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Pretty also, cool. what was cool about Israel is that the weather was really nice. It was yeah. super sunny like all the time, and we had a hotel right by the beach. So oh, that was dope. Nice. Yeah, yeah. And also, yeah, it was great. Wow, yeah. Jerusalem. Good yeah, yeah. it's one of my favorite trips of wrestling. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Can you can you top that, Rufio? Jerusalem, Israel. Uh, Jerusalem. Where 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 have you wrestled? We know you wrestled in Australia, obviously. Uh, Australia, Malaysia. Okay, that's okay. Uh, England, Wales, Germany. Uh, that's all. No, no. I thought you went to the USA. You did not wrestle there. Oh, yeah, uh, I trained there. I did a training camp. Oh, okay. I mean, I did a training match. I don't know if that counts as a no, he wrestled, match. He wrestled. On, no, he didn't get paid, so we'll say. <laughs> Sounds like an NXT <laughs> contract. Oh, what? <laughs> what are you talking about, <laughs> man? Anything like that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's it. Yeah. You yeah. know, Shad, you were telling me you were a vegetarian, but you're full of bologna, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, oh, I don't know how much of a vegetarian <laughs> I can be. Well, I definitely like to beat meat, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Baldi, mate. We heard it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, we heard it. Yeah. Yeah. Shaga. You yeah. disgusting. Yeah. I, was, I was practicing, uh, man, I was practicing a little move that I learned, that I saw from uh, the legend, from the legendary Ron Jeremy. Oh, okay. 
He's a legend in the game. Oh, right. Speaking what of game, <laughs> <laughs> the porn game, obviously. Yeah. Are you trying to get into porn, Shadow? Well, I thought I'm about it. I'm like trying, trying to be a budding actor. Yeah, in man. In the world of pornography. Well, you never know, man. In a few years, man, you're not going to be interviewing me about my, my porn career. But it hasn't got started. Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, I don't have a podcast or a radio <laughs> no. show or whatever. Yes. So yes. I'm not planning on that. Yeah. <laughs> I never planned on having a porn career, or, you know. Yeah, yeah. Who, who knows? Yeah, it just happened, baby. Yeah. <laughs> So, Rufio, uh, in your time during wrestling, your uh, six-year career, did you say? Yes, correct. Over these six years, is there any, um, I don't want to call them stars, but like, is there anyone that people may have heard of that you've met along the way? Uh, Pop on Jörn Simmons, obviously, (laughs) obviously. Big old beefcake Jörn Simmons. Yeah, beefcake of wrestling. Yeah. (laughs) Beefcakesofwrestling.com. Hit us up. Um... Uh, big names. Uh, great Carly. Yeah. Have you heard of him? Yeah, yeah I've heard of him. You've, you've uh, met him. Uh, I've, trained I've him. wrestled him. You wrestled him? I've wrestled yeah, him. Yeah, how? Yeah. Well, seriously, uh, like, how? Like, how did you wrestle the Great Carly? Oh, that's calling uh, the not so me... Great Carly, but. Oh, he's great. I love the Great Carly. Yeah. He gave me a brain chop through a table. Wow. Yeah. That's something that happened in my life. Wow. That's, that's yeah. a pretty impressive. Yeah. Right. Um, Robinson Reed. On NXT. Okay, UK, yeah. Uh, formerly no, known regular, as Jonah Rock. Formerly known Jonah Rock. No, not NXT UK, regular NXT. Oh, regular NXT, yeah, okay. Yeah, man. He just debuted today, actually. Okay, you can check that out. Shout out to Bronson Reed. Um, Robbie Eagles. Uh, he's, uh, he's killing it in New Japan. Killing it in New Japan. Um, there's another big name. Uh, oh, I've actually wrestled Tony Storm once yeah. like in a multi, oh, really? multi-person match. Oh, okay. No way. She's yeah. hot. I think she's... I'm allowed to say that. I mean, is... sure, man. Is there any way you could get my number to, to her? Is there any way you could... Probably not. No? Okay. It's worth a try. It's worth a try. It's worth a try. She yeah. 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 Uh, I think that's kind of it as, as far as people know. Yeah. Okay. And then we go to Yen. Yeah. Who, uh, who in the this sports entertainment, wrestling, grappling world would he's not big name. I don't like to call him big names, but people more well, known, well, more people known people who are super famous. No, nah, doesn't doesn't know huge just, names. Okay, huge names. Long names, really long. Names. Hard names. Oh. <laughs> I wrestled Walter. He has a huge name because it's all in caps. Yeah, yeah Walter. Yeah, you know, all in caps. You correct. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Why would you do that? I don't but know. What was that like when wrestling Walter? It was fun. It was easy. I've known, I've known good... him for a year now, so. Oh, before yeah. he was Walter. I mean, no, he was always he's Walter. Not... Oh, yeah. 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 I don't know how long he's been. I don't know how long he's been Walter. Yeah. That's but... his name. Yeah. Is that the actual name? Yeah. Legit yeah. Walter. Yeah. Walter what? I don't know. I'm not going <laughs> to expose his last name. Oh, yeah, people, yeah. Might be, people might be after him, actually. Yeah, you're, you're right. Yeah. yeah. IRS yeah. and stuff like that, yeah. Yeah, but I've wrestled him. I've wrestled uh, Tyler Bate ah, so from NXT Tyler UK, Bate, yeah. right? I wrestled Double yeah. Jota Jeff Jarrett as well. Wow. Yeah. Uh, Where was that that you wrestled Jeff? WXW, man. Oh, we came to Germany. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Big time. Big, big fight feel, as some might say. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know like what other like stars or big names that I've wrestled. Uh, Paul Cruz. Really? I, I wrestled once. Yeah. What was his name, man, before? Uha Nation. Uha Nation, that was it, yeah. When, when he was Uha Nation, obviously. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Uh, I've wrestled Marcel Bartel. I've wrestled most of the guys in the NXT UK roster, let's be fair. Or at least plenty of them. Good, yeah. Because uh, I wrestled Ilya Dragunov as well. I guess is a big star now, too. I don't know. I'm getting passed up by all these guys. Rhea <laughs> Ripley. Rhea Ripley. Like Rhea Ripley yeah. I wish I could wrestle Rhea Ripley. She can go. She's Australian? She sure is. She's, do, you, do you know her? Or is she from your name? I'm not saying all Australians know each other, but she's a wrestler, I mean, you're a wrestler. You're not far from. Like, <laughs> <laughs> most, most people in the Australian wrestling scene know each other. So yeah, I have met okay. yeah, Rhea Ripley. Yeah, she's okay. lovely. Yeah. Yeah, she definitely plays the character well. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm a fan. I'm definitely a fan. Yeah, I think she should, she should be on TV, like on mainstream she TV. Is. 
Yeah. No, she I mean, mainstream, mainstream. She, she should be up there kicking ass with. Sure. I mean, we would. She's not far from it. Yeah, yeah, but give her by the end of the year, I reckon we'll, we'll see her. Yeah, we'll see. Fair. I mean, we'll see shit. I mean, yeah. apparently you're the expert. <laughs> <laughs> if I say she's going to be on TV, she's yeah. going to be on TV. Right on. Hell yeah, dude. Wow. So, um, that was obviously in Australia that you met Rhea Ripley. Is there anyone yeah. else Australian names that you met, like the Iconics? There, uh, I, yeah, I've met them. You've met them? I have met them before. Okay. Um, just if we've been on the same show together in Sydney. Um, uh, other big names that you're asking, like yeah, WWE. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I've never met Buddy Murphy. Never met Emma. Oh, Emma, what about her? Um, I've Emma. met Emma. Oh, you guys met. Oh, you met, you met Emma. Yeah. Okay. What? What was that? She Where was that? WXW show, man. Okay. Met everybody from WXW. I met Billy Gunn. Fucking up. Road Warrior Animal. Wow. You know, uh, Gangrel. Gang- yeah, Gangrel's been around here as well. Yeah. yeah. We've got uh, Gangrel on the show as well. Oh damn! Yeah, uh, yeah. Who else has it been? I met I met Bob Holly. Yeah, I respect yeah. him. Yeah, definitely respect. I met Brian. Ken- I, I I actually wrestled Paul London. Oh, um, okay. yeah, forget Shit. about that. Real wow, quick. that's actually I actually really like that match. Yeah. <laughs> Where can people watch your matches? At X, at, uh, WXW, WXW now. Is it's it like a pass? Yeah, that's like, that's what their on demand service is called. So if one can check WXW that out. WXW now. WXW now, so go and check that out. You can see all these big names that Jörn's talking about. And you can see the man himself. Yeah. And also, I know he's not here. <laughs> I know he's not here right now, but I see you repping the shirt of one Julian Pace. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What, what can you tell us Sorry about him? About <laughs> I've seen a few clips of him, man. He's, a, he's a good high flyer. He's a, yeah, he's, I mean, he's, Julian Pace, he's from Germany. Yeah. He loves to wrestle. Uh, that's that's is that far as it goes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You, uh, Rufio, you wrestled him didn't you last week? Where was that? Where did you wrestle him? Uh, Attack Pro Wrestling. Attack Pro Wrestling. Mm-hmm. Where is that base? Uh, in Wales, I believe. Okay, yeah. so all you Welsh people out there, yeah, go and check it out, man. Go and yeah, uh, Attack Pro Wrestling. Attack Pro yeah, Wrestling. We have a lot of Welsh listeners, Chad. Well, we we don't know, but if the they, they will know where to go now, if there are any Welsh listeners out there, I don't know what. Um, Go and see Attack Pro means in um, Welsh. I don't. I don't. I'm not familiar I'm with sure the Welsh. Welsh people. They speak English, English too. Yeah. No, they speak Welsh. They've got yeah. their own language with loads of letters and loads stuff. of letters. <laughs> like every other language. No, but they'll, 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 have, they'll have like an A. They'll have like no, actually, they'll have like a P, and then they'll have a K, and yeah. then they'll have a T, and an yeah. R, and it'll spell yes. Yeah. Or yeah, some yeah. weird shit like that. So. Yeah. Well, but, uh, well, I respect the country of Wales. Yeah. And they like Attack for Wrestling, so come and check it out, Welsh people. When's your next show? When when your next... Uh... Uh, at the moment, the next show that I'm on is uh, North Pro Wrestling in Newcastle on okay. July 27th. July the 27th. That that's, that's not long. That's about mm-hmm. a week away. Yeah, a week or two. Who, who are you really wrestling on that day or night? Uh, me and uh, Fraser Thomas in a tag team match. Against uh, Zio Knox and uh, Benji, who everyone is calling now a bumhole. <laughs> yeah, that's legitimate. Speaking of bumhole, <laughs> I bet, I bet you're wondering where am I going? Where are you going with this? No, 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 no. I saw that you had a um, a, a, com- a comedic type match, uh, like a universal match. Ah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. My uh, falls count. Anyway, anyway, literally anywhere. Inter, interdimensional falls count anywhere. Interdimensional yeah. falls count anywhere. That's yeah, a fucking mouthful. Match. It's a match I created in Australia. Oh, man, Where can people see this? Because I feel like I've saw it. Uh, it's a wicked match and people it's need to on, see It's that. on YouTube. I wrestled a guy called Humanity. He wrestles as a, a manatee. And, uh, <laughs> pretty He's actually dressed up as well in a full costume as yeah, well. Yeah, and that as well. And then, uh, yeah, we wrestled in different dimensions. Oh, yeah. Um, and yeah it's something you need to see like it's yeah. not something you can describe really is it something no. you have to i mean that's exactly what i described is we wrestle in different dimensions but yeah yeah crazy and then you came up with that idea and edited it yourself and, and you put it out there Edit? there's no editing here man no no i mean like you i created you cre- the idea yeah you created the idea. in my mind that that's what i mean edited yeah. in your mind yeah yeah wow 
Do you come up with that idea yourself, or is it something that you've seen or uh, bor- borrowed an idea? Or Cause that's what wrestling is really like borrowing, recycles. No, really, that's, really, that's what the entertainment is, man. Well, well yeah, you can just that's underline that. That's kind of what the world is. I want to put it out there. Rufio is a definitely an original idea I made up that no one else thought of. Ruf- so, really? Yes. Uh, okay. Yeah. Anyway, interdimensional falls count anywhere match is a match I created by myself. Congratulations. Yeah, thank are. you. No, no, it, it was actually a good match. Thank you. Yeah. It was, uh, mm-hmm. I did enjoy that. How many stars would you give it, Shad? Well, I'm, Shad not into, I'm, not, I'm, not into, I'm not all into all that, that stars, man. I'm not, tuna, right, I'm not yeah. the tuna melt, sir. I don't believe in all this. What about uh, ticks? How many ticks? So you said a thumbs up or a thumbs down, and then I'll give it a thumbs up. Oh, thanks, man. I'll give it two thumbs up, in oh, fact. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Whoa. Two thumbs up. Two thumbs up from wow. the Shad, man. The Shad. That, that's big praise. That's, that's better than five stars. But, you know, is it? <laughs> well, it says who? It says me. I don't know. That, 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 that's, that's enough. Uh, Yearn. Yeah, that's me, baby. What's your uh, five star match? Would you say in your that you've had? Have you had many five star matches? Oh, I don't think I've had any five star matches. Yeah. But you, what's your favorite match that you've had though? And against who? Um, you said you enjoyed the, uh, Ken, the Kendrick, not the Kendrick, Paul London match. Yeah, the Paul London match was fun. That was good. <laughs> oh, could you grab me a beer uh, as well? Yeah. Right. Oh, hey, Cheers. don't ask for too much now. <laughs> I don't know if we can no, carry two at the minute. I've already given you this interview. I oh, know, yeah. Once in a lifetime. Once in a lifetime. Um, I felt blessed. Yeah, I, re- I really liked the match with Paul London. I also really liked uh, my hair for his hair match against David Starr. That was cool. Um, I did a street fight once that lasted about half an hour, Good, yeah. which I really liked against Bad Bones John Klinger. Uh, I think those are probably my top matches. Okay, that was all um, WXW. Yes. Okay, I think we really need to uh, check out this uh, WXW. And um, how much is the subscription? I think it's like ten bucks a month, something like that. Will you be returning there anytime soon? Yeah, man. I like, uh, they don't have any shows in July, which is when we're taping this, right? I don't know when you're planning. Yeah, yeah, July. Yeah. But, uh, which is why I'm in the UK now. Um, but then from August onwards, I'll be doing a bunch of their shows again. Okay. So I'll be back to Germany in August. Yeah, man. I mean, I'll go back to the Netherlands and live there. So I'll be traveling to Germany on the weekends. And I'll also be going to Toronto, Canada yeah. in August to wrestle. And then also the next day to New York. But yeah, so, that's some miles, that's some mileage. Yeah, I wasn't planning on driving him. I'll have somebody else drive. <laughs> 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 wow. So that you're obviously your, your, your ultimate goal is to end up in the WWE. Yes. Is there that anyone... Is true. Who's on the roster now? Would you would you like to wrestle now on the current roster? Brock Lesnar. Brock B- Brock Lesnar. No, just Brock Lesnar. Oh, just Brock Lesnar. Trish. Rick, Rick. Yeah. Trish. Trish. Trish yeah. was still on the, on the roster for yeah. sure. I think you're a bit too manly to wrestle Trish. Why, man? What, what does that mean? Yeah, what does that mean? That women aren't allowed to wrestle men anymore. No. no. Which is uh, yeah. amazing to be proven, yeah. Well, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean, Rufio? Hell yeah. So you, wouldn't, so you want to go to Suplex City, is that what you're saying? Yeah, sure. Good deal. Seems pretty dope. I'd, I'd rather you than me, so that's, that's for sure, man. Brock. But then again, you know what those people say this about Brock, like, oh, he's, a, he's an animal and there's a monster and that, but to be honest, he's, he's safe. He's, you watch him and he's really safe. How do you know, man? Because, just, no, just from watching, from my two functioning eyeballs, Right. The way he throws people around, and he sells as well. I'd, I'd say Brock, Brock's pretty safe. I mean, I guess we'll have to find out. We know. will, when, when you make it there, and, yeah. you, and you give me a front row ticket, so I can to I see really you. I doubt it. <laughs> oh, okay, it's like that. I've known you only for a little bit, Chad. I don't know, like, if I'm... You wouldn't give, give me a front row ticket? Well, I'd rather give, like, my mom or something a front row ticket, you know okay. what I mean? Like... No, that's, that's fair, actually, yeah. Mine's just I, mean, I would hope it is, you know. <laughs> what about you, Rufio, man? Diggity, 
What's if, you, if, you, if you made it to the main roster, you will make it to the main roster because you've got skill, you've got talent. Thanks, mate. But no. not everybody with skill and talent Apparently makes it. Apparently, I don't. Uh, no, what's up? Yours, you will. Well, but people can't see you right now, but I'm going to put you over right now. Yearn, if you're going to make, a, if you've got a company, this is the guy you build your company around. He, oh. he looks like the part. He looks, think of Dave Batista, but yeah. the Dutch version. Yeah. Yes, yeah. I popped him. Yeah, I popped him. The go. Dutch Dave Batista. That's, that's Picture right. that. Shout out to yours. <laughs> shout, shout out to Big Dave. Yeah. Fuck yeah, dude. Um, <laughs> yeah, man, shout out to Batista, man. Yo, he's, he's doing things right about now. He is doing things. Well, so <laughs> everybody does something, yeah. Well, not everyone. I don't know if you noticed around here, we have a lot of homeless people. And, uh, Ooh, yeah. Okay. What are you talking well, about? Okay. Have, I, have I switched the moods? I've switched the moods, haven't I? What's going on? I was, I was just talking about the homeless people. Yeah, it's, it's a serious problem. Maybe you actually should go around, man, and give, train them to wrestle. That, that, that's an idea, isn't it? Train, train the homeless to wrestle. Oh, dear. Yeah. No? This is a weird thing to talk about, man. I feel very uncomfortable, I'll be honest with you. Probably because you're sitting on the chair upside down. What you're yeah. talking about kind of sounds like an It's Always Sunny episode. In Philadelphia. The, the gang. The gang no, shows. no, the, the other It's Always Sunny. <laughs> the gang trains films, people in wrestle. Yeah. I would watch it that actually. Ugh. <laughs> so Sorry. nice. You're killing it, man. Crushing it. Ex Excellent. Tear it. <laughs> So as I was saying, uh, yeah, if you position. when you make it to the, the main roster, yeah, the yeah. WWE, before yeah. you go to before you leave WWE and go to New Japan, that is, who on the roster would you like to wrestle with? On the WWE roster? The current one now. So you get you get there in the next six months. Uh AJ Styles. Oh that's a good that's a good one. Okay. That's a good one. It's pretty good. Oh no, wait, uh, yeah, the Undertaker. What am I talking about? I wrestle the Undertaker. Yeah. yeah. There is okay. Would you would you uh, want to take the tombstone or <laughs> would you put yourself over? Man? Would you want to beat the Undertaker? I'm not taking anything, brother. <laughs> <laughs> Just put him in, put him in a headlock. Yeah. Well, <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, that's that's good. I like I like the AJ answer. I, I do like that. That would be a pretty good match. Yeah, you don't like the Undertaker. Yeah. Nah, well, I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna edit that out because, because, because there for you is like two friends fighting. <laughs> yeah, who do I cheer for? Yeah, you're like I don't know. <laughs> and and let's let's be real. There's a serious chance that you could probably injure the Undertaker if you gave him your finisher. Yeah, right. I mean, like legit injury. Right. You are really dangerous. I right. am. Yeah. Dangerous man. Yeah. The world's most dangerous man. Oh, Rufio. <laughs> <laughs> I like dangerous. Just a little. Yeah, just a little. Just a little dangerous. Wow. Well, so Rufio, where mm -hmm. can people catch you? Uh, the one to higher or to say hello or you know maybe ask you uh, out on no, a date or something I'm not tell you where I live um okay you can catch me on at Rufio Wrestling R-U-F-I-O Wrestling that's on Twitter yeah on Twitter uh Instagram uh and that is all I don't have Facebook at the moment yeah. okay at Rufio Wrestling yeah or if you're interested in booking me or for me to come to your Chinese restaurant contact <laughs> Dot Rufio at gmail.com. Okay, there you have it. That's it, man. Yeah, man. And then, Yearn, where yeah. can people find you but not send you presents? Where can they find you? They want to book you, they want to chat to you, say hello, become a fan. Where can they find you? At Yearn Simmons on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. And if you want to book me, you can just DM me on there. Nice, nice, nice. I don't have an official. No secretary. I don't, I don't have an official Twitter or uh, email for my uh, for my bookings. So. Well, soon you'll have that blue tick, man, and uh, everybody will be, be looking for the. Everybody will be yearning for yearn. Oh, <laughs> there <yeah>. you go. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, <dude. laughs> you have no idea yeah. how happy you just did. <laughs> I popped him. <laughs> <laughs> well, I said, I said, I, I, I'm going to quit while I'm ahead, man, and I'm going to end this interview now, man. But oh, I want to thank you guys, man, for, for, for coming through hey, and uh, yeah, giving no me some of your time, you're man. Welcome, and hopefully, it wasn't too awkward, and you know. I've had more awkward yeah. interviews. We can all get dressed now, and uh, you know. Again? <laughs> what is this? Shad. I am completely dressed. Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, man. 
I can, jump I can obviously tell that you are completely dressed as well. Yeah. Um, uh, You're wearing some slippers. Yeah. 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 Do you think you're a twig or a beefcake? Yeah. Oh, that's my, that's my turn. That's a question now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah man. To be fair, like, he, it's a tough question. It, it is, it is, is, son. Um, I'm going to go for the beefcake. Beefcake! Okay. Is that okay? Mm, I don't mm. agree. Oh, uh, man. I mean, what's wrong with being? What's what? Why am I not a beefcake, man? I mean, I, I feel like you're gonna be. You have. You need to have a lot more size to be a beefcake. Yeah. True. Yeah. So you're borderline twig. Borderline beefcake. No. Just you're borderline, borderline twig. More on the twig side. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. You know what? I'll, I'll get whatever I can take. I've, I've got no gimmick at the minute, man. So I will be the the. The twink, the, I'll be the twinker taker. Yeah, hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> the, the twinker taker. The under twinker. The, the under twinker? Yeah, yeah. There you go, that's even better, man. I'll be the under yeah. twinker for, for now. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Nice. Do it. I love it. Get after it. Get in it. Cool. Well, I'll yeah. catch you guys. Oh, sorry. Oh, yeah, actually, your last words for your fans out there. What have you got to say? I'll, I'll give it to Rufio first. Uh, Shad's a twig. <laughs> That's all I gotta say. What you I'll, I'll, I'll accept that. Yen? Sip it up and sip it tight. <laughs> Oof. Is that just for your female f- fan base or? No, it's just for everybody. Oh, for everybody. He's <laughs> a fan of everybody. Okay. Oh, yeah. yeah man. And I'll just say keep it locked on the BDSIR network and we'll catch your asses next week. Peace. I'm out. gonna tell y'all with a tear in my eye. This is the greatest moment in my life. I'm a one-man gang, feeling like a giant and I can't be slammed. So don't even try it, start a riot. And I don't give a damn, taking off your territory like I'm Vince McMahon. Cause I'm the man, the icon, the showstopper, rhyme dropper, looking for a whole hopper. Any diva, AJ Molina, Lana, Jackie, Trish, Tori, even the Keebler. I'm sick as a fever. Walk the earth without a care. Fuck it, she bear till she screams like Ric Flair. Better prepare tables, ladders, and a chair. I eat, sleep, repeat. That's how you better beware. It's like a nightmare. I'm sweating, leaving my sheets soaked. Cause I'm never forgetting when the street broke. I lost my house, my kids. I walk the streets broke. I'm about to jump off the top like steamboat. Wrestling with words. I'm just wrestling with words. Getting aggressive with. Verbs and it's testing my nerves, my knowledge. Do not test me, I'm nerd. It's absurd how I know every win, loss, and when it occurred. I'm troublesome. Can I walk past some bubblegum? Who's next?